Hey guys, what is up? Let's do a toy unboxing. It'll be fun. Okay, so I'm super excited because I have a bunch of stuff that I got from American Girl. Not a bunch, just like a handful of stuff, but I got this stuff for free. I had like, I don't know, I had like a hundred points. I don't know. I had some points and I used them to get the clothes that I really wanted to get and I hadn't gotten. So I'm just wearing a kitty cat pullover. Isn't it cute? And look, you guys got to see this. It's got kitty cat ears. Meow. Super cute. And some gaming console earrings. So I'm a little worse for wear because you have no idea what I did to my room. I legit organized all of my coloring books and I literally um, had to clean up this whole entire desk area. Let me explain. Okay, so my mini refrigerator exploded. Dun dun dun! So what happened was I accidentally turned it to heat instead of cool and I should be checking out right now to make sure it's on cool. So I don't know if you guys saw my room tour. I did a room tour and I showed my desk, and my desk has a tablecloth on it to protect it from, you know, nicks and scratches and anything. Because I use this for my makeup, I use this for crafting, I use it for hauling. So I just, I had it covered. Thankfully I did have it covered though. So, I had to take off everything that's up here. All of my um, cutie cute stuff, all my knickknacks, everything had to go. And I had to redo it. And then I was like, well, since I'm redoing that... I might as well redo some of the stuff that I have over here on my bookshelf. And so I basically just reorganized everything. And then I got some fun stuff in the mail and I thought, why not show you guys? And I'm a little worse for wear. I'm not sweaty. I took a shower. I smell like coconuts. Mmm, I put on like this nice, fresh um, coconut cream pie perfume that I have. I didn't even know I had that. It was lurking on my vanity, which kind of shoved in the corner, and I was like, ooh, let me put some of that on. So, first off, I'll show you the American Girl stuff. This is the Street, Sweet Street Collection, and you guys have probably all seen this. It's those shorts that are so, so cute. They're track shorts to me. They look like track shorts. These are probably going to go on Courtney. I think she would look really good in these, like the little 80s-esque. I'm kind of doing a modern 80s vibe for Courtney. I'm putting her in some modern pieces, but... It's still vibe with the 80s aesthetic. So I did get the Sweet as Candy Twist Tea. That was really, really cute. I love how they offer you points because I wouldn't have been able to get any of this stuff if it, was, if it wasn't for points. And then I got this little um, minty sweet tank top. It looks like a little bralette. Isn't it cute? It's adorable. I absolutely love this. I just want to kind of see what it's made out of. Let's just open it. Why not? So... Oh, that's loud. Sorry. That was loud. But I wasn't going to open it. I was just going to show you. But I kind of want to see what it looks like. Ugh, obnoxious much. Oh, this is so cute. It's got a little Velcro, like they always do. This is adorable. I love this. It would actually look really good with those shorts. Where are those shorts at? It would actually look really good with the shorts, I think, and maybe a little jacket and some sneaks. And then I did get the Double the Sprinkles skirt. I thought this was super cute and I really liked it. So that's the stuff that I got from American Girl. And then my mom got me these really cool unicorn napkins. I always need napkins for my coffee station at my sister's, so these are perfect. And then let's show you what I'm starting to collect. It's so exciting as a collector when you see little pieces that are clear on your shelves because that means that you could add more stuff there. But I'm not adding more stuff because I have three things that need to be put down there on one of my shelves. And yeah, so that's happening. Okay, so I finally got the Cutie Cars Cupcake that I had seen about three or four years ago at Target. I'm serious, like three or four years ago. They don't make cutie cars anymore. They're not around anymore. I'm starting my collection from scratch, and I absolutely love this. So you open it up, 
and that pops open. Sorry. Get that little thing out of there. And you just put your cutie cars in there. And you're like, what are cutie cars if you've never heard of them? Well, I'm starting my collection from scratch because the boys, when they were smaller, they took a lot of my... I don't mind. I gave them to them. I gave them a lot of my cutie cars. And they loved them because of the pastel colors. They didn't look like boy cars. They look like girl cars. And they're super cute. So these are cutie cars. And this is the exclusive one that came with this. I paid, I actually paid $34 for this. And this was, it was probably a little bit less in the stores. It was probably like, I think at the time, I remember it being like $26. But they're becoming harder and harder to find. And they're not, you know, they're not sold in stores. So you might be able to find this at a thrift store. You might be able to find it maybe at a Ross. But I saw this years and years ago, and I wanted it, and I never bought it. So this is the color change cuties. It looks like this. It's super, super cute. I absolutely love this. And it has the little Q-tip type thing where you could change colors. I'm not going to do that. It is just the perfume car, and I thought that was really cute. I'm actually going to leave that in the package because I want to take pictures of it. And then... This is the Cutie Cars, three mini Shopkins included, die cast bodies, wedding wills, and these are super, super cute. You know, I am going to open these. I'm going to open all of this up. I wasn't going to. I'm probably going to pause this, take some pictures, and then um, show you what they look like. It's really strange. These came from Germany. These were not made in Germany. I don't know why the person had these. But, yeah, the package that I had said that they came from Germany. Something fell. Oh, I think it's the checklist. It's the checklist. So I just thought these were really cute, and I love them, and I miss my collection of them. And this is so cute because they're all wedding bells. Um, I'm not a romantic at heart, but I just thought the, the cars were really, really cute. And um, let's see if I can pop these bad boys off. Oh, they're all taped up on the bottom. Oh, but it seems relatively easy. So, I don't do a lot of content these days because um, I'm really, really busy. And I know you, I know it's like everybody. My sister's officially, you know, kind of going back to work. So, I'm with the boys by myself more these days. And um, it's a lot. It's a lot. Why did I not open this off camera? Let me do this off camera. So basically what I'm saying is I have zero time these days because my sister is going back to work um, three days a week. I think the tag on this is bugging me. But yeah, so I'm just with the boys 24-7, mostly by myself now. And look at this. Look at how cute this is. This is the wedding cake. I think this is supposed to be the wedding cake, yeah. Or it could just be a cake. If you're not a romantic you could, and you're soured on romance, I do not like love. I spurn the love. You could say it's just a sweet treat truck. I do not spurn love. I think love is beautiful and wonderful. If you can find it, yay. For me, it is what it is. Um, but like I said, I'm just not a romantic at heart. I just love the mint color and the pink colors and all of that goodness. That was awesome. And I'm one of those people that does not display their loved ones on camera like a trophy. And I say this with love. I know a lot of girls who have, you know, shown their boyfriends online and they've done the vlogs and they've done the whole thing. You know, they're a big part of their YouTube channel and that's all well and good and until you break up. So I'm not going to show anybody on my YouTube channel that I'm not invested in. Unless I'm married, which I'm not. I'm not going to show anyone that I may, you know, be a... Uh, have a friend. You know, I'm not going to show anybody that I date on my social media because it's so awkward when you have all of these videos and all of these pictures on your Instagram and your YouTube and then everybody's like, so what happened? And they want the dirt and they want the gossip. When you suddenly break up, it all becomes, you know, somewhat dramatic and gossipy and all that good stuff that people like. 
So I don't, I'm not one of those girls that will ever parade somebody online and be like, hey, this is my, you know, whatever. So that's kind of, people always ask me and I'm like, I keep, I keep a lot of my private life private because it's, I don't want it out there. And I know girls who have to like literally purge their whole social media and all of their pictures and all of their videos. And it's just like, yeah, unless you're married, maybe then, but this is my world. This is my time. This is happiness. And I don't, you know, I do talk about the boys and I talk about my sister, but you know, for the most part, um, this is my time and I like keeping it my time, my world, my way. And I like to keep a little mystery. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? So they have a whole checklist here and it is and I always find it fun when people who are doing videos like this, they do talk about themselves a little bit. And that's that's all well and good. I hope you guys like knowing a little bit about me. When I do stuff like this, I tell you a little bit of info about my everyday life. Oh, some of these are so cute. Ooh, they have a Pretzel Express. They have a coat. <gasps> I want that coconut car. Now, I'm going to have to go hunt for these online because they don't sell them anymore. They have a Raspberry Roadster. A wheelie musical, a nacho nacho van, a roller skater one that looks really cute, a gumball one, catch up, they have a whole bunch, an egg cart, a rapper rider. Wow, these are awesome. A toasty teapot. Oh, the toasty teapot's really cute. Ooh, these are so cute. They have a poop coop. What the heck is a poop coop? Okay, that's interesting. A baby buggy. A Ringo car. A Toots Le Ma Macron. Oh my god, these are so cute. So anyway, they're all on this checklist. And I think the ring one is my favorite. If you do 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 oh, put a ring on it. Oh my god. Beyonce. If you liked it, then you should have put a ring on it. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. I hate that song. I'm not into poppy songs. You know me. I like more the Susie Band. Susie and the Banshees, The Cure, The Decembrists. How come I can't open this? Hold on real quick. Something that you guys don't know is that I really, really, really love um, The Decembrists. <laughs> It's like my favorite band in the whole world. It's indie folk. And then my other favorite is I Am Not Shane. He's a bop. I Am Not Shane is a bop. He's like the most thoughtful lyrics. Lyrically, he just is amazing and funny. And he has like these bops, like these pop songs with the most tragic lyrics. And it's epic. So I really like that. Look at that. Isn't that so cute? Okay, and I think this one goes in here. No. The ring goes in here. This is the only one that doesn't have a top to it, which is weird. Hmm, I wonder if this one's missing a top. Okay, isn't that cute though? That's adorable. I love it. You're always going to get me talking a lot in these videos because it's what I do. How am I going to get this dude in here? Oh wait, this, this pops off. So you can have a little minivan that has a... Okay, so I'm trying to figure out... Oh, this is the cake piece. So they all come with like a little... Oh, it's upside down. They all come with these. And I'm not really that excited about these, but I'll put them in there anyway. Because they look like they're driving the car. It doesn't even stick. I guess you have to have little kid fingers to get it in there. Yeah, because I can't get it in. Ah, this is ridiculous. Okay, you're just going to sit there because I can't get you in. Mm. Okay, I got it. I got it in. Thing is going to frustrate me to the living end. How does this go in? Aha! See? That's awesome. This one's probably... I love them all. I keep saying which one's my favorite, but... Um, and this one just has a little thing with you going there. I'm awkward and weird and all over the place when I do these videos. Um, 
This isn't a kid channel. I refrain from cussing, but it's still not a kid channel because I do talk about adult things. And I'm trying to get this in here. Okay. So if you're a kid and you're watching this, God only knows why. Okay, so look at that. Isn't that cute? They're metal. They're adorable. I absolutely love them. And here is the last one that I'm going to open up for you. I kind of do want to do the color changing thing on it, but I'm not going to because hashtag lazy. And the checklist fell. And that's okay. They're not really on here that well. It's just that it seems like it's hard to open, but it's really not. It's one of the actually easier toys that I've had to open as I struggle here. I'm trying to open this. I might have to pause the video again. I'm always pausing the video because getting these little things out is ridiculous. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to pause the video. Okay, that's interesting. You could see how it's gonna change colors. You know, like right back there and right there. So that's kind of cool, I like it. Let's see what it looks like in here. Um, let's see what they all look like in here. Where is, okay, I am missing something. Hmm. Oh, there we go. There we go, Jolly Bean car. So let's see how they look. I'm gonna put them in here. I want to put them in here. Oh, I'm gonna need a whole bunch more of these. I think I'm gonna go on eBay or Amazon. And look for more. I need one, two, three, four, five. I need five more. And then my collection is complete. Ah! Oh, that was an epic fail. There we go. They all ran out. <sighs> Into the hemisphere we go. But anyway, I think that looks super cute. I'm going to go on eBay right now and see if I can find some more. So I'm excited for that. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. It's so cute. I love this. It's adorable. So, they keep falling all over the place in there, but okay. Anyway, I love you guys. Three pieces of me on. Have a happy day, night, year, week, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe, jump on the friendship bandwagon. We do a lot of fun things here. You can watch me mess up and flub every single video that I ever make because that is what I do. That's this girl. So, with that being said, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.